I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. Investors remaining concerned about the global economy following the Dow's 800 point drop on Wednesday. Many focused on the trade war with China. China announcing it will take necessary countermeasures after the U.S. earlier this month announced an additional 10 percent tariff on $300 billion worth of Chinese goods. Now the president tweeting out on Thursday, quote, our great farmers know how important it is to win on trade. They will be the big winners, end quote. The new rule Main Street Index shows the trade war is continuing to have a negative impact. The monthly survey of bankers showing the numbers dropped to the lowest level in two years, falling below growth neutral for the second time this year. The overall index dropped to 46.5 from 50.2 in July. The researcher behind the survey, Ernie Goss, says the trade war with China and the lack of passage of the USMCA are driving growth lower. Farming history is about to be honored in southern Illinois. This marker will be placed at the site where the state's first soybeans were planted in Alton, Illinois. Back in 1849, Dr. Benjamin Franklin Edwards traveled to San Francisco where he helped shipwreck survivors from Japan. In return, they gifted him Japanese peas. Edwards returned to Alton and gave six of the peas to a friend who planted them in his garden, and the rest is history. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime at agweb.com and make sure to follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.